Okay, let's have a look here. N goes to infinity. So this looks like it would just be the integral from one to three x dx this one here would be the integral from zero to two five x squared minus three x cubed the x this one would be zero to one sine squared two pi x the x this one here is the sum of zero to one of cos squared two pi x dx. In the following exercise, given the left or right as indicated, express their limit as a definite integral. Okay. Kind of similar again. Okay, okay. Um, hmm. So, okay. Um, Hmm. Zero. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to think here. That's the DX. So, if I just rewrite this sum, i over n minus 1 over n, so, okay. Well, n is going to infinity yeah so that would be zero to infinity um one over x dx You know, I'm just a little bit confused here with the index. No. Zero to one. Ah. Yeah. Yeah. I guess an x dx and this one's the same it's just the right one x dx so this one is two um one plus two x the x Zero to one again. Although, because they took the two out here, I feel like they might be wanting you to think about it as zero to two x. Which is the same, I believe. So I think here they want you to think of it as zero to three, 
3 plus x dx. And this one here will be 0 to 2 pi. x cos x cos x dx this one here um, one no um hmm Hmm. One to two x log x squared dx. Maybe I'm right. Let's see. Okay, so starting with sixty one and then sixty three and then sixty five. And then 67. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's funny because if you didn't want to start at the one, uh, I mean, if you didn't want the one here, you could change this. And likewise, you can see here in 67, they changed that to three to six x dx so this actually is equivalent to one to three x dx um and 69 x log x squared one to two yeah yeah so these ones you can move the integration and you can remove the two and the three yeah okay okay let's have a look now Um, right, let's see. Um, okay, we've done those. In the following exercise, evaluate the integrals of the functions graphed using the forms for areas of triangles and circles and subtract the areas below for the and subtract the areas below the x axis. Yeah, okay. Let's do these ones. Seventy. <laughs> Seventy one, seventy two, seventy three. Oh, some more seventy three, seventy four. Seventy five. Seventy five. Okay, let's check the answers as we work. Um, solutions. Okay. Okay. So let's see now. This is a circle. A half. Uh, pi r squared. Plus a half. Pi. Two squared. Plus a half. Pi. Three squared. Nine. Ten. Fourteen. Seven pi I think. Um, a half the base by the height, so that's two times two, so that's two. One, two, three, four, four times two is eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, eighteen, nine. That's so that's fifteen. Okay. Um, a half pi r squared 
4 times 4, uh, minus 4, 6, plus a half pi 9, 5 pi minus 4, a half pi r squared plus a half pi r squared, or it's actually a minus, plus a half pi 9, 9 plus 1 is 10, 10 minus 4 is 6, 3 pi, 2, 2 times 2 is 4, 4 times 2 is 8, 6, 9, 11 minus 4 is 7. Okay. 1, 1, 2, 3, 4, minus a half pi times 4, 6, six times 3, that's a 9. So that's 10 minus 2 pi. Okay, let's check our answers. No, 71. 14. 2, 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 times 2 is 8. 8 divided by 2 is 4. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. It's 18, that's a 9. 2 times 1 is 2. Divided by 1. Ah, 14. 2 times 1 is 2, of course. Ah, okay, uh, 73. Oh, again, Stephen. Two times one is two. Uh, Seventy-five. Okay, let's double check these. A half. Okay, one plus four plus nine. I think that's right. Let's double check this one. A half pi one, yeah. Four times two is eight, that's a four, yeah. Two, three, okay. Ten, five, I think that's right. A half pi, okay. One, two, three, three, okay. Nine plus one is ten, ten. Nine plus one is ten. Ten minus four is six, divided by two is three. Okay, I think that's right now. To be more careful with my Mental arithmetic. Disgraceful. Okay, let's see. Then we have some integration to calculate. That's good. Yeah, okay. Okay, okay. I think that's a good place to leave it there for today. So that's up to question 75 done.